She started with five aces entering play today through the first three matches. She's already got two in this first set. Mayberry winds up, touches the block. Ashburn got a fist on it on the right sideline, and it's going to go out of play off Franklin, however. So High Point records its first kill. Wisconsin up 13-4 in the second. Gooch check in on the right sideline. Gives it up front to Hamill. Left side attack, Franklin. Dug out by the Panthers. Left side slam by Mayberry, denied. Back to high point. How about the back row? Palazzolo got it right between Ojo and Guccekin in the middle back. Wisconsin six points away from a 2-0 lead. Here's Anna McDonald to serve. Van Eckern to the left, Mayberry. Right off McDonald in the back row for the kill. Cross court, got the score. John Adias, Pete Waite with you here at the Fieldhouse. Crawford goes down the sideline. Here comes High Point. Satter dumped down by Van Eckeren. High Point, tax to the right, touching the block. Grigorski, right hand save. No, it touches the court. Row and Reckl were all the way up above here on the press row and couldn't see that one, but the referee better look than us. Taylor Trammell. And the replay there, Trammell just up. Set to continue play. It's the overhand serve. Dug up here by the Raiders and the kill, but denied here by Bilinovic. Left side, almost a kill there for Hannah. Here's Bayless, and a shot at it. And Weatherington gets another one. Yeah, Weatherington just bringing the storm right down there. Ball in the hand of Taylor Cigna. Here's her serve. Dug up cleanly by Kershen, right side, the kill by Allie Holland, ending the second set and giving the Nittany Lions a 2-0 lead. The AVCA all Northeast region team last night. They both lead in digs tonight and last night. And there's another one. Off we go here in the third set. We almost started off with a kill there for the Nittany Lions. Nice dig there. Raiders left side pushed back over by the Nittany Lions front line. Good rally here to start us off right side. Here's Weatherington. What a save though by Bilinovic. Here's Weatherington again blocked back. Left side. Kept alive here on the Raiders side. Kill by the Nittany Lions. Taylor Trammell decides to end the rally. And the Nittany Lions got the point, but I have to say in that sequence, I really, really liked what I... Here it is from Van Eckert. Dug up here on the Raiders' side. It's dropped there by Trammell. Left side, Hannah. And getting it to fall, Cameron Hannah. And this one just riding along the net there did the Nittany Lions. With the overhand serve. Dug up here, and the kill by Taylor Trammell, her fifth of the match. You see the kill, Rachel Martinez, as you see it in the replay, just playing a... Bilinovic, cross-court serve off of Hauschold, and a light tap across by Reza Tarski. Left side, going for the kill, almost getting it there is Angelina Stark, and she will end up getting it as the Raiders can't keep it alive. All of a sudden, Colgate on a 3-0 scoring run. And this one placed over, almost a kill, but a nice save by the Raiders' side. Placed over again, and getting it is Ali Van Eckeren, almost had it. Registers her first kill in the kill department for this match. Yeah, right there, how she gets one now in 2023. Stark serves this one over. And the right side, Hauschold, dug up there by Stark in the back line. Here's Hannah, lightly tapping that one over and getting the kill, yes! Here's Altercott with the serve. Pardon me, that is Sidney Jones doing the serving. Putting that one down hard is Ali Hall at Penn State. And keep your head on a swivel when you're in the... Serves across, dug up by Bilinovic. Right side, going for the kill, and this time getting it Alexa Markley with her first of the match. It's over 26 matches last season. Only started nine of them, but she finished the year with 100. Which way will it go? It's a good third set between these two. Rachel Martinez serves it across. Left side and tapped over gently onto the floor. Angelina Stark, kill number three.
to this sweep. Time ACC academic honor roll back at Clemson. Beautiful dive there. Nice save there by the Nittany Lions right side. How showed looking for the kill. Nice save though by Billinovic. Cameron Hanna looking and it. She dies. Game. Nittany Lions pull off the sweep against the Colgate Raiders. Season in the fourth time they've swept the Colgate Raiders. And you gotta give a round of applause to Cameron Hanna. Put this one away. Dukes try to stay alive. They will bring it over. The crowd getting into this one. Kershaw pops it up. Teed up. Holland brings it down, but. Duke's able to retrieve it. Set up by Watkins. Feldman fires. Blows back Grimes, but she keeps it alive. Teed up to Mercik. Mercik fires. Blocked back down, but out of bounds. And Mercik does it yet again. Two away. Be an exclamation point on this invitational, something that. Allows Allie Holland as well to get a reception as she walks off. Terrific game from her. Of course, Jess Mercik continuing on out there as she sends this one over. Set back over, and what a shot for the Nittany Lions. Outside to the Wetherington back in. Players on the bench just waiting their turn, and all it takes is a nice spark, somebody like Zoe. Awkward set, but Chacoin gets it over. And that ball is in. Trammell with Holland out there on the floor at the same time as Holland serves. Trammell this time rattles around. Point Penn State. 21-14. Well handled by Villanova. Merzik. Oh. Close out November here in the regular season. Matches they really do need for their RPI as well if they want to be back in rec call for the postseason. Taylor Trammell doesn't want to see her rec call playing career come to a close anytime soon. They're within six. Van Eckeren taps Weatherington, who drills it down the line, puts it away. Penn State wins it. A four set victory for 14th ranked Penn State. Nittany Lions had faced their challenges earlier in this step. They're able to get it done, and who other than Zoe Webb?